Hello, welcome, pass the cast for perrygirls.com. Oh, the tribe numbers. I am a Heart Tribe member as well. I am part of Heart Tribe 25. We're numbered um, from 1 to 25. I think 25 is the last one. Um, a groups of four, mostly. Most of the groups have four. And we all support each other, watch each other's short scopes, encourage each other, give each other hearts, hearts, hearts. We always want hearts. And that's the fun part. And I have gotten to know so many people through Perry Girls, through the Heart Tribes especially. I feel like I'm popular. I was never popular in high school, but now I am popular. People love me and I love it. If I would have known that this would make me a popular chick, I would totally have done it a long time ago. Of course it didn't exist, but you know. So everybody, you make sure you are following perrygirls.com. And if you want to have a more intimate experience, get hooked up with the Heart Tribes. It is really, really fun. I have been doing it since the beginning. Oh my gosh, this is my fifth beat. Crazy, craziness, but I love it. And I'm going to scope on vacation. I'm about to leave for Florida on Wednesday. I live in Michigan and I forgot to introduce myself. Ah, oh my gosh. Anyway, my name is Holly Amarande. I am the owner of Yummy Life Wellness. Um, I am a holistic health and life coach, and I specialize in helping people to transform their relationship with food so that they can finally lose weight, get healthy, love themselves. I am actually going to Orlando. We're going to Walt Disney World on Christmas Day. I am insane. Y'all have to commit me because this has got to be the most insane thing I have ever done. Um, I live in Grand Rapids, Michigan, and we are not flying to Florida. Hell no, we're driving to Florida, which is even crazier, with my in-laws. Isn't that nuts, y'all? Why am I not in the mental institution? It's crazy, crazy, crazy. But it'll be it'll be fun. So I'm going to scope on location. Um, and before I get in my car and do the awesome car trip of the century, I have another Christmas party for my side of the family, which also gets a little wild and crazy. So I have some food prep to do. So tomorrow I am making a caramel apple cheese ball. Anybody like cheese balls? This I've never made this before. This is going to be really good. Um, I am a steeped tea rep as well as being a health coach, so I got this caramel apple cheese ball mix. It's actually got tea in it. How crazy is that? And it looks really yummy. Mix some apples. Yummy, yummy, yummy. So I'm going to make that. And I'm going to make cornbread. Um, it's like a potluck. We all bring stuff. Um, so super, super fun. Um, I guess I'm the last one and Kara Allen is closing out this thing. So make sure you're following Kara or Kara. I hope I'm pronouncing your name right. Um, so Kara, if you're out there, throw up some emojis so we can all follow you to the end of the train. Hello. Anybody else have any holiday parties to go to? Anything fun to do? Um, I have to give out these. I made all these for the show. The little tea samplers. And I still have lots of them left. I need to give them away. I think I'm going to go stand on the street corner and give them away. You think that would be weird? I don't know. I can't have all this Christmas stuff in here. Open studio tomorrow. What is that? That sounds fun. I love I love this time of year. Normally, and it finally snowed today, so it feels a little bit more Christmassy. Um, but it won't be when I'm surrounded by palm trees. I'm used to... Oh, artist. Awesome. Um... Yeah, I am ready. I am ready to celebrate, to get the party on. Last day of school for my daughter today, so it is everybody's officially on vacation. Yay! And I'm going to be scoping with my crazy in-laws over Christmas. It will be funny, 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 funny. So if you guys want some comic relief, make sure you're following me and share with your followers. Shorts, see that's the one thing that I like about winter is not having to wear shorts. I like to not have to shave my legs. I'll admit that. I like pants. Um, and I don't really like having to shave, you know, other things. <laughs> I won't say what. Um, where's the sleep? Oh my goodness. 80 degrees. Oh, that sounds nice though. Not in Florida. No. 
I like warm weather though, I do. I'm just looking forward to a little vacation. I haven't had a real vacation in a long time. Um, so I'm hoping to, we can get away from the crazy people and have a nice time where we can go maybe see a beach. We're going to go see the rockets at Cape Canaveral. So it'll be fun, five days. But I'm going to miss my puppies. Shave and have sun. I guess I can shave. I guess I can. I think it'll be worth it. I just don't like having to do it every single day. It's the only thing I like about winter. I don't like snow. I don't do cold sports. I just like to just be able to be warm and cozy. I like being warm no matter what. Even when it's cold outside, I wrap myself up in blankies. I would wear a Snuggie 24 seven if I could. I don't even have one. I want one. I love these Christmas trees. Aren't they cool? Go ahead. Oh wow, summer in Chile. That sounds fun. Awesome. Yes, Kara Allen is next. She is going to close out our afternoon past the cast today. And then I'm going to go get my cheese ball on. She's getting ready, so we'll just chat. Um, is anybody Who likes real Christmas trees? Anybody like to get a real tree every year? My tree, I love this leg shaving conversation, it's so funny. My tree is like really tiny and my daughter put it up as if I wasn't even going to put it up. I'm like, we're not going to be here. Who cares? Um, but next year if we're going to be here, I'm going to get a real tree. Even though my cat is likely to eat the tree and die. I can't keep her away from the tree. She's very, very naughty. My cat is the naughtiest kitty ever. She's already, she sits and gnaws on the branches of the fake tree. And change the what is that I think that might be a typo <clears throat> I like the smell of the real tree so I take I have essential oils I'm an essential oil person so I usually rub my tree with my my pine oils to make it smell authentic in here um, I just don't trust my see my pets are gonna be here with a pet sitter so I don't trust my cat alone here with my tree she would have it rustle to the ground and probably choke on the whole tree because she would try to eat it. She's that insane. So insane. <laughs> I haven't had a real tree in years, but I think I'm still finding pine needles from the last time I had a real tree. So that's the only thing I don't like, all the cleanup. If they could make a tree where the needles didn't fall off, I would be all for that. Ooh, Kara Allen is live, so I'm going to jump off. I'm going to get off my scope and go to hers. Got to close out the show. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.